Frank Stuff is a story about American ingenuity and just all around optimism and endurance. Do you really believe that? Like, it's not even a bunch of garbage. Like, you actually do believe that that's something, this movie makes you believe in America. So, we got these pilots, right? It's the 50s. And here are these pilots, and they want to be the fastest man alive. They want to go crazy speed. And now they're being offered to work for the space program. Isn't that great? Like, can you imagine? So, the first part of the movie is them trying to, you know, surpass each other, go Mach 2, all this stuff in the planes. And the other two-thirds of the story are them trying to get up into space and, you know, succeed and beat the Russians and all that stuff. The great thing about this story is that it's not told in, like, an American propaganda sort of way. It's told in a way where you believe that this is what America would really be doing. Now, I want to name two actors that were absolutely fantastic in this movie. Ed Harris and Scott Glenn were fantastic. The thing about Ed Harris' character is he's just always a good dude. That's all he ever is. And there's always this thing where you're like, is he? And then he is. Scott Glenn is just charismatic, he's fearful, he's this flawed hero heroic man. And you really just, they're the two guys you root for. All these other astronauts, and they're all kind of scumbags who sort of cheat on their wives and stuff. And you're like, ew. And so, it's... it's but the interesting thing about that is that we get both heroes that we can root for, and, com and emotionally complex and morally complex characters. One problem that some people will have with this movie is that it's over three hours long. But, that is okay. Because every single scene in this movie is completely necessary, and it totally should be three hours long. And when they go up in, like, the planes or in space, you feel that they're in danger. Like, everyone's always like, oh, they're in danger. And you feel it, too. You understand the danger that these guys are putting themselves in. And that just makes the whole movie that much more engaging. So then we, every time they go up into the sky, there's this feeling of exhilaration and fear and wonder every time. And that's something that's very difficult to pull off. This movie has drama, it's got, it's got every single thing that you could possibly need from a movie. And it really is, in that sense, kind of a perfect movie. It really is of the highest caliber and deserves to be watched. And it's on Netflix, so you really have no excuse. You need to watch it. It's just brilliant. Right Stuff absolutely gets an A+.